Well, John and I got up at four o'clock this morning. We're gonna, it's uh, just a little after five and we're ready to head out uh, just to try to deal with the temperatures. So it's a uh, first time on the bike trip, 26 days in and uh, getting up earlier just so we can get on the road right at daybreak. Yesterday felt weird uh, just because of the uh, rest day at home. Uh, just kind of want to reflect on uh, mental state of mind today. It feels back to biking normal. <laughs> so just like you get up, you do your routine. Uh, it's just me and John and uh, I don't feel so bad. I feel really good today uh, mentally and physically. So you've been used to seeing the mountains, then the hills. Now we're in the Mississippi River bottoms grounds, nice and flat. I'm thinking about I can switch to it, and I'm thought about it. I'm not. The one by is okay, but it's it's not the best. So, where did you start? You said you've been going uh, around San Diego. Okay. I started in uh, Chester this morning. Okay. okay. How about you guys? Um, we're gonna go to Murfreesboro. Uh, yeah, we, we were at Mur Murfreesboro is where we started it this morning. Fairfield. Oh, uh, that's no. Missouri. Oh, uh, Farmington. Farmington. Oh, Farmington, not Fairfield. Yeah, Excuse yeah, Al's place. Very awesome. Okay, yeah, that's, that's why that's what we're heading. hiding for. Yeah, that that's place what we're, is awesome. Yeah. That's what we're shooting yeah. for. Where a long day. Uh, I don't know. I think maybe a little campground. I'm not really sure. Uh, okay. It's kind of off the map. Okay. Uh, where'd you stay last night? We stayed in Murfreesboro at oh. the at the Bud at America's Best Inn. So we haven't been on the road that long. Yeah. How, how much was that? Uh, Seventy bucks. With Seventy-one dollars so for two people. Yeah. He he kind of gives cyclists a you know a little bit of. Yeah. 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 Is it stinky? No. No, I mean it's the, the it's, motels I've been in. They're all smokers. Oh, this no, one ours this one. wasn't. Ours yeah. wasn't. Yeah. America's yeah. Best, huh? Yeah. It's yeah. Right there, in Murfreesboro. Yeah, but you you probably get there pretty early if you stop yeah, I there. Yeah, I left. I get up early yeah, that's just what we to do. beat the heat. Yeah, yeah that's, that's what we're trying exactly. to do. Yeah. So how was it coming across Kansas, or did you come across Kansas? I thought the drivers were awesome, the roads were awesome, the people were great, very Good. considerate. All right. I liked it. Yeah. 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 Now, where you from? The, the it got a little bit tedious. It's so monotonous, yes. you know, everything's yeah. the same. Yeah. So now where are you from originally? Uh, Hawaii. Hawaii? Okay. Oh, cool. Yeah. All right. How about you guys? Uh, North Carolina. Uh, actually, I'm like three hours north of here, but I started in Virginia. We started in Yorktown. We're doing the whole train. <laughs> yeah. Oh, you are? Yeah. Nice. Yeah. All yeah. the way to? Yeah, Astoria. Uh, I was going to Seattle. Yeah. Same friend, so. Uh, yeah. see here is coal being unloaded off the rail and then uh, being moved around and stored uh, it's a terminal on the uh, Mississippi River early this morning we're stopping for lunch it's pretty pretty easy but uh, we've done 42 miles this morning so uh, yeah we thought we'd just hang out here by the Mississippi River and and uh, found a place where we could stop we're getting ready to cross uh, the bridge at Chester into Missouri so there you got a, a view of the bridge that we're gonna be going across
just gotta stop. So we made it to uh, Farmington, Missouri, and we're staying at the Old City Jail on the second floor, which has been converted into a bike hostel. So uh, for those people who watch YouTube videos on the Transamerica or cross country routes, a lot of people stop by here uh, for a good reason. It's a really neat place to stay. So you kind of get a chance to see uh, they kind of got a living area set up where you got access to the television if you wanted to watch that. Uh, more importantly, laundry. Uh, one of our mottos has been when you, when, uh, what was it, John? What, how did we put it? What's that? Oh, when an opportunity presents itself, take advantage of it. So, yeah, we're doing laundry. Uh, they got a nice kitchen. Uh, Kevin is from... Uh, Indiana or uh, the Indianapolis area. Yep. Uh, so uh, uh, he was here when we got here, and we and the three of us went out for supper this evening. And, and of course, you can see Kevin's blogging like everybody else tends to do on these <laughs> on these trips. But if you take a look, you know you can kind of see you know bike stuff all over the place. Uh, the guy they call it Al's uh, something hostel, but uh, he was a local person. Uh, from this area that raced bikes uh, passed away a while back and they've uh, set this hostel up in, in honor of him uh, so you kind of see what's what they have there the bathrooms uh, just a quality job to uh, to help cyclists out uh, and then uh, they got bunk beds set up for everybody and if you want sheets and blankets and stuff like that pillows they have all that they got internet if you need the internet and then uh, this is kind of where John and I are staying so we just kind of took over the space in here and uh, um, get all our stuff set up so yeah that's uh, where we're staying at 